Hi, my name is Bob Metcalf, and I'll be speaking to you for the next minute or two uh, on behalf of Avastar, uh, a company on whose uh, board I serve, and I'll get back in a minute and explain why. My claim to fame is Ethernet. Ethernet was invented in a memo I wrote on May 22, 1973, at the Xerox Palo Alto Research Center. Uh, that was 30 years ago, if you... Uh, think about it before personal computers get that before personal computers today I'm a venture capitalist and I'm frequently asked what the next big thing is going to be and uh, to which my consistent response is uh, the video internet uh, yes I know video conferencing has been a big disappointment and there are all those unused uh, video conferencing rooms out there but uh, video is uh, coming back and will uh, inexorably become the next big thing. A problem with that is that Ethernet was not designed in 1973 to carry video. It's being packetized, digital, packet switched, internet protocol kind of thing. So we've been busy over the last 30 years fixing Ethernet for video. First thing we've been doing is making it faster. It started out at 2.94 megabits per second, then the IEEE standardized it at 10 megabits per second, next 100 megabits per second, a gigabit, uh, 10 gigs now coming on stream, then maybe 40 gigabit, 100 gigabit, and so on. But speed is not the only uh, problem in carrying video. Of course, there's a delay or latency or the variance of delay, commonly known as jitter. And we're working on uh, fixing that, too, by uh, reducing number of hops in the Internet and uh, uh, speeding up the routers and giving them cut through QoS uh, and so on. Of course, while the plumbing is being fixed, we're getting new displays, and today's displays are gorgeous, and they're getting even more gorgeous at a rapid rate. It doesn't pay to buy a display these days, because if you buy one today, tomorrow there'll be a much better one available for a much lower price. And then there's cameras. We used to worry how we were going to be able to afford cameras, and now we all have a camera, and soon we'll have hundreds taking pictures from every which way. So we'll have video telephone, and we'll have video conferencing done the right way, and we'll have video email, video on demand, video merchandising, video instant messaging, of course, uh, and then, say, video file sharing. Imagine teenagers exchanging movies the way they today exchange uh, uh, CDs. Uh, so it's going to be very exciting over the next 10 years as we upgrade to the video Internet, and that's why I'm on the board of Avastar, where I can perhaps help but at least watch uh, uh, the upgrade go on. I urge you to stay tuned.